How to make a car rotisserie from scratch. A car rotisserie is an invaluable asset to any restoration project, enabling you to save both time and space by easily working on both frame and body of your vehicle. The Best DIY Plans store offers several car rotisserie plans to meet any individual specific needs, with features like false frames for more separation between frame and body, and hand cranks that allow 360-day rotation of vehicles. Car rotisseries are essential tools for anyone involved with automotive restoration. By providing access to all sides of the frame and body of your vehicle from multiple angles, they make working on hard-to-reach areas much simpler. Although commercial rotisseries may exist on the market, you can build one yourself using wood and basic carpentry skills if desired. In order to start out, several essential materials will be required, including steel plates, wooden boards and metal brackets. Once your rotisserie is assembled, it is imperative to test it thoroughly before beginning work on your vehicle. Begin by visually inspecting its structure for any cracks or other signs of damage before checking to make sure all connections are tight and secure before slowly loading and unloading the vehicle while rotating it several times to check for signs of instability or movement. To build the base for your rotisserie, start by cutting Twox 4s and 2x6s into 4 pieces measuring 8 feet long by 4 feet wide. Assemble frames using metal brackets and wood screws at their corners before attaching casters at each frame's bottom so it can easily move around your garage. For the rotisserie arms, cut one half inch plywood into three foot squares. Drill a hole at the center of each square and insert a steel pipe through this hole into each of them. Connect these steel pipes to vertical supports using nuts and bolts. Once completed assemble by screwing onto each vertical support. Once your rotisserie is assembled, you can begin working on your car. First, place it securely on the rotisserie before slowly rotating it while carefully watching for any signs of instability or movement. If any problems arise during rotation, stop immediately and make any necessary adjustments. Once your rotisserie is secure and functional, you can begin working on your car. With some patience and the appropriate tools, you'll soon restore its former glory giving you years of enjoyment on the road ahead. Materials. Car rotisseries can be invaluable tools in your restoration project, providing easy access to hard-to-reach areas of your vehicle from all sides. While there are various kinds of car rotisseries on the market, they can often be costly. However, with basic woodworking skills you can easily construct your own and save yourself some cash. In this guide we'll show how you can build one from scratch using this method. Start by gathering all of the required materials, 2 2x6s, 4 2x4s, 8 feet of 1 half inch plywood and metal brackets and screws will suffice. When you have all this together, assemble the frame of your rotisserie before moving on to building its rotation mechanism. Rotation is controlled using a harbor freight hand winch equipped with a worm drive, providing smooth and consistent rotation without needing pinch bolts. Furthermore, its position can be changed to alter its angle of rotation. One end holds the car with its 3 quarters inch hitch pin for stabilization while its other side contains a set screw with holes drilled at 90 asterisk increments for additional adjustment options. Once your car rotisserie is constructed, you can use it to complete your restoration project. However, before doing so, it is essential that it undergoes testing to ensure its safety and functionality this will prevent accidents or injuries during work on your vehicle. A deluxe rotisserie is an invaluable asset in any car restoration shop, helping save hours spent laying under vehicles supported by jack stands while reaching hard-to-reach areas. Additionally, painting will become much simpler without worrying about paint seeping under or onto the underside, plus tight spots become much simpler to access. Our rotisseries come equipped with eight casters so that they can maneuver into and out of trailers, up ramps or uneven surfaces with ease. Assembly. Employing a car rotisserie will make working on the frame and body of your project much simpler, enabling you to access areas otherwise hard to reach with traditional methods of work. Furthermore, using one can save many hours spent under your car while trying to clean, prep for paint and primer application and maintain balance under it with jack stand support. There are various car rotisseries on the market, 
each offering distinct advantages and drawbacks. When selecting one for your project, take into account its size, weight, location and accessories such as universal door bars for connecting quickly to valance supports, leaf spring brackets or body mount brackets. Once your rotisserie has been assembled, it is ready for use. Before using, ensure that its casters are locked into position, inspect the legs for any signs of damage or wear, replace any that are damaged as soon as possible and grease bearings on casters to ensure smooth running action. Next, install long connector rails between both ends of the rotisserie. These should be constructed out of two square tubing or two angle and should have at least one eighth of wall thickness for strength and reliability. Using quality material should allow sliders to be welded securely to these rails. Lastly, you'll need to install your winch that will rotate the vehicle either using an old hand winch you salvaged or purchasing one that features a reduction ratio of 40 to 1. Install the swivel heads that allow the rotisserie to pivot freely, such as those found at an automotive parts store. After they are in place, check their position again before making any necessary adjustments. Testing. Car rotisseries are essential tools for car enthusiasts, mechanics and restoration experts alike. Allowing for easier access to all parts of a vehicle's body and frame for cleaning, polishing and painting purposes as well as improving overall quality, these devices allow easy rotation for easy cleaning of every part. You can even use one for other tasks like welding and sandblasting. Although there are various car rotisseries on the market, selecting the ideal one for your needs requires understanding how it operates and its available features. A good model should feature a brake system to stop it moving while working on your car. Additionally, there should be a locking pin to secure its place preventing slipperiness from the rotisserie and making your work harder. Consider also the weight capacity of a rotisserie when selecting one. Certain models are only designed to handle smaller vehicles while others can support full-size ones. Also ensure your choice is made of sturdy materials such as steel or aluminum. Heavy-duty models will hold more weight, making them great choices for restoring larger vehicles. When purchasing a car rotisserie, make sure that the brand you select has an outstanding track record and excellent reviews online from previous customers. Also look for one with a warranty in case there are any problems down the road with its use. As with anything expensive, a car rotisserie can be costly. To ensure you find the best value deal it is wise to set a budget before shopping and compare prices before making your final choice.